Worley sat quietly during the two and a half hour hearing today. At many points, I did see him asking his attorneys questions. At the end of that hearing, the judge did ask Worley if all of his needs were being met inside of the jail, and Worley replied yes. Now, James Worley is facing several charges and if found guilty, could be sentenced to death. Because of that, both the state and defense are making sure everything is being done correctly so that there's not any reason for an appeal or mistrial. Since last summer, when Worley was arrested and charged, his attorneys filed 58 motions. Concerns or requests they have headed into this trial. Items like jury selection, evidence, and whether or not the news media can be allowed in the courtroom for the trial. Almost right now seems to be a superseding requirement in the state of Ohio. I'm not saying that's good or bad, I'm just saying that seems to be the fact of where they are. The judge ruled on many of these motions already. Those still have to make decisions on others after hearing arguments today. Several members of Sierra's family were inside the courtroom today. They did keep to themselves, but Sierra's boyfriend did post on Facebook and he said, quote, it's a hard thing to do, but we go for you. And it goes on to say that we will continue to be here until justice on this earthly plane is served for you. Reporting tonight, Michelle Zapata, WTOL 11.